In fact, I think from now on, we ought to say it twice. Okay. Go ahead. The End of the Innocence by Don Henley right there. Three times would be good, right. just in case people don't have a pin handy. Should we do the record label? Isn't it? <laughs> That's <laughs> a good idea. <laughs> what, what label is that, son? Uh, uh, Crystalis or something. Huh? White. Well, it's a white label. White label. Thank right. you very much. It's 809 now at KEGL. <laughs> Boy, have we got a hot Labor Day bash planned for you. We were all sitting around the conference table thinking of new uh, ideas, and they, they didn't like my contest that I brought up again, stare at the sun until you win a free dog. <laughs> <laughs> so they've decided again to go with that uh, the Village Country Club, which is a good second choice. We're going to be out there on Labor Day with live music, water volleyball, and poolside games. We packed thousands of people in there last year. We do this on Memorial Day and Labor Day, and it is a bash you don't want to miss. The bikini contest alone is worth the price of admission, which is free. It's absolutely free. <laughs> let's see, from 11 to 1230, there's no cover charge. And the Village Country Club at Southwestern and Carruth Haven, just off Greenville Avenue. We've got some good bands this year, too. Mm -hmm. Kenny and the Casuals, Moving Colors. Colors and extreme heat, all playing for your listening and dancing pleasure at the Village Country Club on Monday. But no Bohemians. No Bohemians. No, Nine minutes after eight at KEGL, we're asking you to call our KEGL opinion line this morning and tell us what you do and don't like about our radio program so that we can make it better. Yeah, I'm really tired of the 530 Club. I think it's just too much talking. I'd rather hear some music in the oh. morning. I think some of the topics you talk about, a few of them are interesting yeah. and just, just too, too much BS. I'd like to hear a lot more music. Boy, this is a controversial thing, this 530 Club. It's split right down the middle. I'm thoroughly satisfied with KEGL's programming and top-notch personnel. My only suggestion is the hiring of Ron Chapman away from a less fortunate local radio station. <laughs> he can make coffee, answer the phones, whatever it takes to keep him off the air. KEGL owes it to its listeners to prevent major accidents near the locations of Chapman's scary billboards. <laughs> All kidding aside, KEGL is the best radio station around. No crap and no rap. All right. Yeah. Thank you, ma'am. Just read the card. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> very good. I don't think there's anything uh, very much that you can do to change the show. Just uh, for the people, for the listeners in Fort Worth, you ought to have, like, you know, more things happening in Fort Worth instead of Dallas all the time. I agree with that. I'm yeah. a Tarrant County resident and proud to be. That's right. So I don't, I don't blame you. And I think KEGL is going to get to work on that right away. Listen, I think it's time for you guys to get new jingles. Those little double oh. shot jingles, KEGL, those things. Sound like they're right out of the 60s. New out of the 60s? 60s. Out of the oh. All right, well, it's funny that he would bring that up because we just had some new jingles produced. <laughs> let's, go, let's go ahead and play one of those. Radio. <laughs> oh, <laughs> geez, that's a great one. <laughs> that lady that called in about the new Bohemians? Yeah. Well, I'm sorry, but I'm going to have to agree with her on that because we can't stand... Ah, queen. No, <laughs> that's not the one. I'll tell you the one that was. It's what I am is what you are, and no, I'm not. You are too, and yes, you are, and I am not. And I'm going to tell my mama. Toby oh. Chan and KEGL's proud to present. <laughs> Let's get a check on traffic. It's a service of It's a Child's World Daycare Center. And here's Hollywood. Inbound, RLT, I-30, 1st Avenue, earlier accident. Still, it's going to be uh, right up being the on-ramp there because of a slight slowdown. The eagle's eye in the sky. I don't know where I am. Yes, I do. <laughs> in the air somewhere over there. I'm Hollywood. <laughs> <laughs> Hollywood. Yes. Dallas Morning News this morning. They say Exxon is going to urine test all 15,000 employees for drugs. Oh, wow. You know, I'm over at Exxon Station right now. Yes. It's all 15,000 wow. of them get <laughs> urine tests. Hope they don't spill that. <laughs> One of the comments we got was, we just don't play that darn wiggle song enough, so we're going to get everybody up wiggling. Wake up toes. Wake up toes. <laughs> it's the Craddock and Company Morning Show, 17 past 8 o'clock. Appreciate you listening this morning.